Hello again. So today we're going to composite a video, uh, pretty much animation frames, into a video. So if you watched the last video on how we rendered out our animation, we actually have a nice folder set up now. So if I look, go to my desktop and into my animation example, I have a new folder called images and temporary. I have all of the frames of my animation. So if I press space, you can see all these different frames and I can go through them just like that. So everything rendered out really nice, but now we want to turn it into a video. So for today, I'm going to show how to do it in After Effects. And that way we'll get everything nice and easily, easy through your project. So the first step is I'm going to go to File up top and I'm going to go to Import and File. From here, I'm going to find that folder. So I'm just going to go to my desktop, animation example, images, temporary. And right here, I'm just going to click the first file right here. I want to make sure TIFF sequence is selected. And I'm just going to hit open. And I'm going to hit OK. And on the top left, you can see now my animations in there. So before we start turning this into a video, we do have to do a couple little changes. And the main one is I have to change this frame rate from 30 because since we rendered everything out in 24 frames per second, we want to do it as uh, we want it to do in there in here too. So I'm just going to right click and I'm going to go to interpret footage and main. So I'm right clicking the composition I have right here or the files. So interpret footage, main. And all I really need to do is where it says assume this frame rate, it should be already highlighted. I'm going to change that from 30 to 24. This is going to save us a little more tr uh, work later on. After that, all I'm going to do is I'm going to drag it. You can either drag it down here or you can drag it onto a new composition. So this little icon with a little triangle, square and circle, and that will create a new composition. And as you can see, it popped up right in my main workspace. So here I could go scrub through it, see all the animation and everything looks really good. So the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the top to where it says composition and I'm going to go to where it says add to render queue. So I'm going to add to my render queue and I'm going to go down here where this render queue is and I'm going to go to where it says output to. I'm going to click on animation.mov. So I'm going to leave it as a QuickTime format just for now. For you it could be uh, an AVI or any type of uh, video format you want. And as of right now, it's currently going to save to my desktop, which should be fine for this project. So I'm just gonna hit save. And all I'm going to do is I'm gonna hit render. Now I'll go through the entire render and you'll hear that little ding. And that's pretty much all there is to it. So if I go, let's get out of here. There's my video. So if I open it up, it will play my video for me. And that's all there really is to it, to rendering your animation in After Effects. Thanks.